Today, crews are working to fix the damage left behind after a car crashed into a Raleigh art gallery in the Five Points area of Glenwood South. CBS 17's Judith Rattana is live, where the business is working to literally pick up the pieces. Yeah, it's still a pretty big mess out here. We're outside of Lily's Pizza and Third Place Coffee. Let me give you a look. You can still see the skid marks from this car who came speeding down Glenwood South. Raleigh police tell us they were going 50 miles over the speed limit, 85 miles per hour. The speed limit here is 35 miles per hour. But we have the trash bags out here for where uh, the business owners of Lily's Pizza was uh, fixing up their business and cleaning up this morning. They said all of this was damaged by. This car coming through. You can see here they had planters out, they had chairs out here. All of that has been destroyed this afternoon. The owner of Third Place Coffee Shop tells me he's estimating at least $20,000 worth of damage. So they had a lot of work to do. Luckily, there was nobody out here when this happened. Lily's Pizza says they were supposed to be closed yesterday and today. Third Place Coffee Shop decided they would still open up. They can, of course, still make coffees inside, but are now going to have to deal with all the things um, that this has, uh, you know, as a result of this. Including insurance issues. Now, this is not the first time they've had issues with people speeding here. We just spoke with a neighbor who says she's been tracking the number of accidents and speeding related issues. We're going to have that for you later on tonight here on CBS 17 News. For now, live in Raleigh, Judith Rathana, CBS 17 News. Yeah, Judith, you know, I live in that area and I can tell you what they are saying is absolutely correct. People will often speed in there, they're trying to make the light. I guess the good thing is there was nobody in the way of this car when the wreck happened. Yeah, exactly. Um, they were supposed to be, uh, you know, lit on a Sunday afternoon. They said there would usually be tons of people out here, but because of the holiday, these, uh, you know, fortunately, nobody, nobody out here was hurt. Wow. All right, Judith, appreciate it. Hopefully they can get everything cleaned up and back in business ASAP.